welcome to a new vlog. It's Saturday afternoon. Um, I got just got back. I went instead of going to the powwow because I've been to a couple powwows in the last couple weeks. I decided to go to the Pride Carnival that they had, and plus it was near my house and free. Whereas the powwow, I would have had to get in my car and pay to get in. So I decided to go to Pride, and I'm actually really impressed that we even have a Pride up here. Totally honest, and there was actually a decent amount of people there. I mean, we had someone literally in the news yesterday or today for burning out on the Pride Rainbow Crosswalk in our city. That's the kind of people that live up here. So I was actually really surprised, but I went and um, found out some really cool stuff about some organizations. Um, but uh, this morning I also started working on The Bird and the Blade by Megan um, Bannon, and I actually already bailed on it. I got to page 152, and... I'll explain in my wrap up why I DNF'd it, but so I'm done that, or not done that, done with that, and I just started, woo, come here, just started working on Onyx and Ivory, it's been calling to me all the last few days, so I started working on that, and I hit chapter five now, I think, so I'm really enjoying this one much more than I was the bird and the blade, so I'm gonna keep working on this, and I don't think I'll finish it today, I have some other stuff that I have to do, um, but, yeah, so hopefully I can get maybe half ish way through this. I'll be really happy with that. And, yeah, that's what I've done today. Hey, everyone. It is Sunday afternoon here. Or I guess technically evening now. I finished the... I finished Onyx and Ivory uh, about an hour ago. I filmed my Tuesday video. I just finished editing. There's a little bit more editing than normal. And you will see when you watch this. So, in the past, this past Tuesday's video. Um... Uh, but now I'm starting to read Ace of Shades. This is technically a reread for me because I read the arc, but I really, really liked it. And it's got asexual rep, so, um, or asexual and bisexual rep, I think. So I'm going to give it another read because it is Pride Month. And yeah, that's probably all I'm going to do. A pretty, pretty quiet day. Just, you know, went out and had sushi for lunch and that was kind of it. So yeah, just going to work on reading. Hi everyone, it's Monday. <laughs> You may be able to tell. It's very hot here. It's like 35 degrees or something like that right now, which I know is not Arizona heat, but I live in northern Alberta. <laughs> it's hot. So I just got back um, from work, and I have... Oh, it's not here. Where did I just put it down? Oh, here it is. I have about two chapters left on Ace of Shades, so I'm going to finish that in the next hour, and I'm so excited. I just got my mail too. And this was it. I'm so excited. The Iron Flower arc from Laurie Forrest, which if she watches this, shout out. Thank you so much for sending it to me. I'm so excited. It is beast size, just like the first book. I think it's like an extra 30 pages long. Um, I'm just really excited about this. I didn't get an arc of the first one. And oh, I'm just... So excited! Ah. And, um, oh, and she signed it! <gasps> awesome! I have the first book signed because I won it in a contest too, but, and she personalized it! Oh, she's so sweet! Thank you, Lori Forrest! Um, I'm so excited to read this. I'm gonna try to get to it at the end of this month. However, it is like 650 pages, um, but I am working on, I have so much overtime that I have accumulated through work, and I've been told I have to start using it. <laughs> so uh, I'm doing that tomorrow, so I'm taking tomorrow, so I'll be able to do some reading tomorrow. Um, I think I'm going to start Heart of Iron tomorrow. I think that's where I'm going to go. And, yeah. I'm so excited. And they announced ah, the novellas that I was complaining of, like, why would you have a cover that pretty and not have it physically sold? Well, 2019, they're physically selling them, both Light Mage and Mon Facet in a bound up edition. I'm so excited. I haven't seen the cover for it. Apparently, it's like a play on both of the covers. So I'm really excited for that. And, ah. but yeah, so thank you so much, Lori Forrest. You're such a wonderful human being. And... Yeah, I'm going to chill. I'm going to finish Ace of Shades today. And I just had such a long day and I've done so much talking for work. I had to do outreach today. So I'm going to like watch a movie or TV show or, oh, I just borrowed some stuff from the library. Um, I may watch Identity Thief. 
or American Hustle or start Strange Empire. I saw like this a couple years ago or I feel like it was a couple years ago. I don't think it got a second season, but I heard it was really good. And lastly, I picked up a gardening book. Um, I think I'm going to look at maybe trying to start, like not green thumb, but I have like a very small backyard and there's not a lot I can do with it. However, if I could like put even just a small box together and put some tomatoes and cucumbers there, then I have my own tomatoes and cucumbers. That's good. And it, like, saves me a little bit of money, even if it's... Actually, it's not even true. I feel, like, offended when people try and charge, like, over a dollar for cucumbers. So, if I could have cucumbers in my backyard, that'd be awesome. So, I'm going to look into it and see, see what I can do. So, yeah, that's been my Monday, and I hope y'all had a very wonderful Monday. Hey, everyone. It is Tuesday evening now. I had the day off, so I got lots of reading done. I actually finished started and finished two books today which I was really happy with because I kind of got delayed on the weekend and didn't read as much as I normally do so I ugh, picking up my books I this morning well really most of the day Red Heart of Iron oh my goodness there we go uh, by Ashley Poston and the uh, I know there were editing mistakes in this but I actually really enjoyed this and then I started and finished The Winner's Curse by Marie Rutkowski. I definitely never say that right. But the covers are stupid. They don't make any sense compared to the book. The book is very dark. I was not expecting that. So, but yeah, so I finished that one now, like 20 seconds ago. So, um, I'm gonna probably just go watch some Brooklyn Nine-Nine and then pass out. But yeah, so that was all I did was I did some reading today and I don't know what I'm gonna start tomorrow. Um, I'm back in, back at work tomorrow, but I normally read a little bit in the morning before I go to work. Um, so maybe I'll start Voyager, because it's like the almost, yeah, maybe the 20th tomorrow. So it's only 10 days. I want to try and get that book done this month, and it's a big book. So maybe I'll just start Voyager, and um, Voyager or Harry Potter, I think. I don't know. One or the other. Maybe both. Who knows? But yeah, so that's what I plan on doing. And I hope you guys had a good Tuesday. Hi everyone, it is Wednesday. It is hot here, so I just finished playing, I don't know what you call it, but you spray the dog with water outside and they love it. <laughs> um, but yeah, so I, I, I didn't get anything in the mail today or anything like that. I just worked today, but I started working on Voyager today and I'm putting the bookmark in now at page 77 which is the chart part which is the start of part three and it doesn't sound like a lot but Outlander is like massive and the writing is really really tiny and there's no like three pages empty between chapters or anything like that so I'm okay with that my goal was 75 today so I, I just peeked past it. So uh, I may read a little bit more before I go to bed. Uh, I'm not sure. I'm just going to relax and have uh, an evening with the doggies and um, probably catch up on some TV. And yeah, that's that's my Wednesday. I uh, hope you guys had a good hump day. Hey everyone, it's Thursday. Sorry, it's going to be a quick wrap up. Um, I worked today and uh, I came home. Well, I, actually, I woke up. 12, 12 minutes before I was supposed to leave for work this morning. So I didn't get any reading done. And, um, yeah, so then I went to work. And I came home and frantically made dinner because uh, we had Sarah Glenn Marsh in the TBR and Beyond book group on Facebook on live. So we just kind of chatted with her and got some questions. Um, but it's like, I'm tired. I'm exhausted. Uh, so I don't know that I'm going to get any reading done tonight. Voyager's just so big and I look at it and feel defeated right now. Um, so I think I'm just going to, um, well, maybe, no, I'm just super tired, really. I was thinking maybe I'll try and do some Sherlock Holmes stuff, but I'm just really tired. So I'm going to take the day off, take a read day off. Ain't nothing wrong with that. That happens in life. Um, but yeah, so tomorrow, though, I think, um, I'm going to start working on, um, What's the, on, uh, I think it's called The Gathering of Shadows, the second book in the Shade series. I can't remember which one's the second and which one's the third one. Either way, I think I'm going to start reading the second one. And, 
yeah hey everyone just quickly wrapping up friday i didn't get anything in the mail um i think i have a couple books coming well i ordered pre-ordered them and i think they come out both on tuesday but i ordered through indigo so it's probably not gonna show up for another like two weeks until afterwards because for some reason despite them being based and shipping out of ontario which takes a week to get here they don't ship it until like the day of or day before release which i just don't understand I, they can see the mailing address but nonetheless um i actually decided randomly last night to uh pick up truly devious um and i very quickly got to page 37 last night and i am now uh, a couple pages short of 200 and so i almost halfway just a couple pages short and i'm really liking it mystery with two timelines kind of up my alley so I have a feeling I'm going to finish this tonight, and this will be the end of my week. And um, hopefully um, tomorrow I can start working on A Gathering of Shadows uh, after I do all my filming and everything. And I'll read a little bit more, more of Voyager. Um, so yeah, that's what I plan on doing. And I hope you all had a good week. And I have to live through you because I didn't get anything this week. So let me know, or other than my arc. So let me know if you got any books this week. I know there weren't any major releases, but let me know if you picked anything up this week. I'd love to hear. And I'll see you all next week.